All right, so a really good shoulder slash core exercise is called the T push-up. It doesn't actually even involve a push-up, but it involves a series of a plank position followed by a side plank, okay? What Travis is gonna do is gonna start, his arms fully locked out, shoulders protracted, so he's pushing up against my hand, okay? He's not sagging in, said. That's not what I want. I want you to have active shoulders the entire time. So what he's gonna do is rotate up, the first progression, he's gonna have his top leg back just like this for a little added stability. If he can achieve that, he's now gonna put his uh, foot on top. Good. What Travis is thinking about right here is driving his fingertips through the ceiling as he's driving his arm down through the ground. Coming to plank. Okay, now he's gonna rotate up again. So each position, I want Travis to hold it for 10 seconds. Driving this arm up, pushing this arm down, really trying to separate those shoulder blades while also keeping his hips up. Rotate down, one more time. All right, and then so the final progression, which is very difficult, Travis is gonna keep his arms driving up. He's gonna go into like a starfish position, where he actually lifts his top leg up. Each position you're gonna hold for 10 seconds. Go ahead, come back down to the plane. All right, I want you to accumulate 90 seconds to two minutes of this drill. It's very taxing and your shoulders should be very tired along with your core, but it's really, really good warm up prior to any sort of pressing or any core activity.